Alright, this is another video that I'm making, and um, it's just going to be kind of like a, uh, a true story that happened, and it's about when the time I met Kevin Hayes, uh, the speed cuber, the one that got the world record on 6x6, and um, I'm a pretty big fan of his, but this is just a couple solves that I'm going to be doing of 6x6, I'm not the best, obviously not like Kevin Hayes, but um, decent, and um yeah, so I'll just get right into it. Anyways, so I was going on Twitter one day, and I had been wanting to meet him regardless. So I just went on his Twitter, and I was like, I'm just going to look at this, see what this guy's been putting or anything like that. It doesn't really put that much. But anyways, he mentioned that he was going to go to a certain competition in the Bay Area, and I live here in California. Um, so... When it said that, I was like, oh my goodness, that's that's right here. And I looked it up and everything, the information, and it said, you know, that it was in San Jose. I was like, that's only like a couple of hours away from where I live. So I started making arrangements, asking some of my friends if they wanted to come with me. And they're like, yeah, you know, San Jose. So we're just kind of making it like a hybrid trip, you know. Just going to go to a competition, not compete, but just to go and look at it. I've been wanting to go to a competition anyways, but I didn't know what to expect. So when I, when we went there, for the first time, I was thinking to myself, okay, first competition, right behind these doors, Kevin Hayes has got to be here. I open the door, first thing I see, first thing I see, I just see him walk right across the room. I'm just, I just, I mean, I'm a, I'm a six foot guy, six foot one, 20 year, well, I was, not, I was 19 at the time, but anyways, I just look at my friend, I'm just like, oh my god, oh my god, it's Kevin Hayes, oh my god, it was like, he's like, my god, dude, you heck of fangirl, and I was like, I am. But anyways, yeah, no, I just got, I just, um, that's embarrassing. <laughs> anyways, so, you know, we walk in, you know, we sit down already, and then he's already going to be doing, like, these solves, right? He's, um, already sitting down, and he's doing the 6x6, six six. I'm like, wow, I came here just in time to see his 6x6 six six solves, and that's why I've been trying to get my 6x6 six six to be just as good as his, because his 6x6 six six is great, you know, the cube itself, and... I did get to fill his cube. He let he let me uh, try it out. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. It wasn't that great. Oh yeah, I said that in the other video. But I'll say it again. It wasn't that good. It was stiff and all this and whatnot. And so yeah. But I guess what it was is after a while, whenever you have the lube and been putting so much lube in it, it just um, it doesn't work. It just kind of slows it down, and you don't use it that much. Anyways, that's not the point. So I tried making the cube again, and it worked out well. But now I just kind of uh, evolved to this, uh, the Moyu one. Anyways, so, you know, I, I walk up to him, you know, and I tell him, hey, you know, you're Kevin Hayes. And he's like, yeah. <laughs> I was like, yeah, it's kind of obvious. It just felt so weird just seeing him. And so I was just trying to ask him a couple of questions, and I just walked away and sat back down. I was like, man, that was a chore. And so I thought, all right, well, let's, let's see if I could go talk to him again, right? I have a couple, of, I have a bunch of questions I got to ask this guy. So, you know, I go up to him and I start asking him a couple of questions, you know, like, how do you do this certain algorithm on the 6x6 because I can't just seem to get it on there. And, you know, he showed me and I was like, wow, that's very simple. I don't know why I haven't thought of that. And I started, and I just kept talking and talking. But what, what was kind of surprising, I mean, I thought this was pretty cool. He invited me to sit down with him along with the other big boys. Um, I wouldn't say that they're, you know, really, I said big boys because they're like, you know, the top people in the whole Cuban community, but they really weren't, it was just really Kevin Hayes, that was part of it, it was just his friend David Adams and another guy, Weston something, I don't even know how to pronounce his last name, but yeah, Weston and David were pretty cool, Kevin Hayes, yeah, he was, it, the com I'm gonna be honest, when I talked to him, the conversation felt very one-sided, wow, I think I talked about this in my other video, anyways, so yeah, it just felt one-sided and all that, but whatever, it was it was it was cool, and we were I was sitting there for a good hour talking to him, and yeah, that was pretty much it. Next day I went, you know, and I wanted to get a, a video of his solve on his cube. I just I mean he he looked really busy, so I mean I think this is what I think I kind of bothered him in a way. So you know I asked I was just trying to get his attention, but he just like, yeah yeah yeah, what do you want? <laughs> it's like. Um, nothing <laughs> I just uh, instead of asking him I was like hey can you do this? just nothing 
And so I just, I just kind of stood back and I just, I just kind of watched him. I was like, Nick, my brother, I was like, let's just go. <laughs> Screw this. And I was kind of upset, but I mean, it's understandable. He gets all that attention. And, uh, I mean, it only makes sense. I just wonder what the other the other YouTubers, speak viewers, whatever, whatever they you know they they experience. Um, Weston, he was he was pretty cool. Weston and David. I wasn't expecting to see David over there, but but yeah, that's pretty much it. So, anyways, this is that was just uh, my whole experience meeting Kevin Hayes, going to the first competition. The next competition I go to, I will be competing in it. I don't know which one that's going to be, but hopefully it's not too soon because I want to still practice and get better and faster so I don't just go over there and look like a total noob. But I've been doing this for like good, officially like three years. I've known how to solve the cube for five years, but I lagged it for like a good year and a half or so where I wasn't doing anything. So technically like three, three and a half years I've been doing it. And averagely I'm like three and a half minutes on six by six, five, 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 I'm like... A minute 40, um, 3 by 3, 20 seconds, 4 by 4. I don't even do 4 by 4. <laughs> I would say maybe like a minute and 20 seconds or so. 7 by 7, I rarely do four, 6 by 7 by 7, so I don't even remember. But yeah, just um, let me know what kind of uh, videos you would want me to put or anything. Whoever out there is watching this. And I have many other stories, and I'm going to be actually posting that. I don't even know why I mentioned asking you guys what kind of videos you want me to post. I'm not going to... Okay, cross that out. Yeah, I'm I'm also going to be putting up some other videos of life stories that I've had. And it's not... I mean, I can't say that I've had many life stories at competitions because that was the only one I had. But anyways, uh, um, yeah...